Hello, this is Monty Hipsch, the Google Guru, and this is our last segment in Google Search Engine Optimization Starter Guide. And it covers three elements, promoting your website the right way, which is what you see here on screen, Google Analytics, and Google Webmaster Tools. So let's start with promoting your website. And Google suggests highly that you, you use blogs, user blogs, social media, newsletters, and direct mail, and posters. And that's all fine, but today what I really want to focus on is the social media element. Because one of the largest indicators of uh, and success factors for search engine optimization is attaining inbound links. So we need to look at the social media sites. So let me bring that screen up. Just a moment, please. And here you'll see um, your universe on the internet these days. It's not just enough to have your company here anymore. You need to look at things like Facebook, Twitter, which is in fact a blogging pr platform, YouTube, the video serving platform, and LinkedIn, your professional resume services online. These four elements are all highly valued by Google. They have authority, so you can actually uh, create a presence on each one of these platforms and then get followers and people to like your uh, pages in Facebook or follow you on Twitter, follow you on YouTube, uh, friend and follow you on LinkedIn. And yes, here we are. Google indexes the social graph. They highly value the authoritative sites of Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and YouTube. And likes often now are the new links. So let me just show you, I've done a search on myself, and it's not out of vanity, but here's my own speaker's website, here you see Monty Hipsch, but what's more important is you see here my Twitter account, oops, and here you see my LinkedIn account, and here you see my YouTube video account, and here on the bottom you see my Facebook account. So on top of my own website, you see four more places on Google that I've created and control the content and I'm uh, and they are showing up on a search for myself. So you need to create presences on these platforms so that you own the social graph about yourself, you manage your reputation online, and in all cases for YouTube, LinkedIn, Twitter, and Facebook, you're often generating the content. So that's a great way to have links and likes and and help your search engine optimization of your website. So please make those efforts today. Now, the second thing they talk about is Google Analytics. This is a used to be a $5,000 a year subscription service from a company called Urchin. Google brought, bought the service and now allows it free to all of you. All you need is a Google account, which is free. You get a snippet of code that you can put on your website. Then you have access to this dashboard visitors, traffic sources, you can see how many visits, the page views, the average uh, pages per visit, the bounce rate, average time on site, how many are new, and you can drill down in here. So without having Google Analytics on your site, you're not able to evaluate the performance on your website, where traffic is coming from, how long they're staying. This is a crucial element for you and your website and analyzing the effectiveness of its search optimization. The last thing Google talked about is Google Webmaster Tools. Now this is a pretty geeky product. Uh, again, you need to have a Google Webmaster uh, account. It's free. You just Google Google Webmaster Tools, and you'll be able to set up. You'll be able to set up an account. You'll put again a snippet of code on your website to prove that you're the owner, and you can take it over. And it provides high-level information, but it is pretty geeky. So um, I think this is something that you either need to outsource. Um, to a specialist service provider or your web developer or your search engine optimization people because it's, it's, it, it is an advanced system and service. Analytics, you can handle. Webmaster Tools, a bit harder. Lastly, remember our eye tracking study. And this is the, the typical search results on Google. We see the intensity here of where your eye is. The X are where people click. Less people on the right, so the top three is the sweet spot. Underneath, as it, as it comes down, less and less clicks. These red lines are where your screen resolution cuts off. So if you want to be found on the front page of Google, you want people to click through to your website, you need to be up here in the left, upper left-hand side, and that's where Google AdWords is its strongest because you can be there within a day. It doesn't take as much time as it does for Google SEO. I hope this has helped. I look forward to seeing you in the future with our new features. Thank you. Monty Hips to Google.